。好，二零二三年嘅第三十三條 MC 咧，我哋繼續講翻呢個糖尿病患者咯喎。喺翻幅圖咧，我哋會發現啦，雖然飲完糖水啦，血糖水平係會升得好高嘅，但係到頭來咧，血糖水平，咦？都會呈現一個輕微嘅跌幅嘅喎、哦，咁題目就問我哋啦，呢、这個血糖水平到頭來都會跌嘅呢個現象，係因為以下一二三邊一個原因呢？咁呢個題目呢，就係、是、考翻我哋三樣嘢嘅，第一就係高糖素嘅作用啦，第二啦就係呼吸作用嘅概念啦，第三啦就係糖尿病點解叫做糖尿病呢？咁我哋嚟做一擊破咯喎！第一個嘅概念呢，就話高糖素嘅作用就導致到血糖呢就下降啦。呢、这個呢係一個錯嘅概念嚟嘅。咁啊，因為高糖素實質係刺激我哋嘅肝臟細胞啦，就將一啲儲存咗嘅糖原就轉化成為葡萄糖。然後啦，再將啲葡萄糖就釋放返去血液嗰處，實質呢，血糖水平應該係上升，因為高糖素應該係當我哋嘅血糖低於正常水平底下，先會釋放得較為多㗎嘛，係咪？咁所以啦，第一句呢，就已經係錯咗咯。然後啦，去到第二句啦，就係、是、身體細胞嘅呼吸作用啦，呢句就係正確啦。咁啊，因為啦，身體嘅細胞。佢真係無時無刻都需要用到葡萄糖去做呼吸作用，去釋放能量㗎嘛。所以啦，啲身體細胞呢就會由血液當中呢去提取咗嗰啲葡萄糖啦。所以血糖嘅水平呢係會下降嘅，呢句係正確啦。而今次呢個糖尿病患者，你發現咧，佢能夠釋放到嘅胰島素其實都好少㗎嘛。所以啦，佢就唔似一個正常健康嘅，又唔能夠促進到啲身體細胞呢。喺個血嗰度吸收更加多嘅葡萄糖啦，就唯有靠個身體細胞自己用到唔夠啦，就喺個血嗰處咧抽取翻出嚟咯。咁第二係答案喎，而去到第三句就講啦，喂呢、這個糖尿病患者咧就係、是、經過血液去流失咗啲葡萄糖啦，呢句都係正確嘅。咁啊，因為啦，太多嘅血糖。係唔能夠轉化成為糖原啦、啊，去儲存喺個肝臟細胞同埋肌肉細胞，導致到啦過多嘅血糖咧，就會去到腎臟，從而啦就被排泄咗出嚟啦。嗱呢句説話咧本身係正確嘅，啱嘅。的確糖尿病患者咧，佢哋個血糖到頭來之所以下降咧，其中一個原因就真係屙咗出嚟啊嘛。咁咪少咗血糖咯，係咪？不過啦，呢句説話係好容易誤導到同學，係以為喺個尿度屙咗啲血糖出嚟，係一個控制血糖嘅方法。呢、这個係一個好致命嘅錯嘅概念嚟嘅。作為糖尿病，有多同學係誤解咗啦。哦，太多血糖呢，咧去屙走佢。就好似一個補償機制咁，嗱，因為而家咧喺我哋嗰個胰臟啊，佢釋放得唔夠胰島素啊嘛，又或者我哋嘅肝臟對於個胰島素嘅刺激唔夠敏感啊嘛，咁所以佢咪做唔到嘢咯。所以啦，我哋個 kidney 咧，我哋個腎臟就醒啦。嗱，你哋搞唔掂嘅血糖咧，我幫你屙走佢。Sorry 啊，糖尿病點解佢係一個病啊？係大家諗真啲。糖尿病之所以係一個病，係因為葡萄糖呢一樣嘢真係容許喺個尿液度出現咩？喂，葡萄糖係攞嚟幫你釋放能量嘅喎，你屙走佢，你咪傻咗啊！所以啦，尿液入面有糖分，根本係你個腎臟辦事不力，係因為喺我哋嘅腎臟嘅近曲小管，佢唔能夠完全咁樣將個葡萄糖。喺個腎小球淚液嗰度吸曬翻嚟，所以就導致到啦一啲未被重吸收過嘅葡萄糖分子咧，就喺個尿液嗰度排走咗。呢、这個先係個成因啊！呢、这個先係點解糖尿病係病啊？係因為你根本唔應該排走啲葡萄糖噶。所以啦，大家搞清翻個概念咯。咁啊，大眾官嘅答案啦，就係二同三啊嘛，所以答案咧就係 C 啦。Say two two three MC question thirty three is about the diabetics again. So from the graph we can see that for the diabetic patient, after drinking the sugary drink, the blood glucose level increased greatly, and eventually it still drops. So the question asks us that. 
the blood glucose level of the patient eventually drops because of the following reason one two three so for the whole question is checking us the action of the glucagon the concept of the respiration and the sign of the diabetics so let's take a look at the answer one by one first of all we talk about the action of the glucagon for glucagon what is the action it stimulates the liver cells to convert the stored glycogen to glucose so you can see that later on the glucose molecules will be released to the blood so the blood glucose level should increase rather than decrease therefore statement number one is wrong answer this question you can see that is checking us the concept of the glucagon the overall effect of the blood glucose level is increasing not decreasing and then statement number two respiration of the body cells it is the correct statement because the body cell it will really consume the glucose for respiration to release energy so once the body cells it does not have a sufficient amount of glucose lower concentration of glucose so the body cell will uptake the glucose from the blood for example by diffusion so that's one of the way to lower the blood glucose level and surely you know that in this patient he or she can only secrete a very small amount of insulin so there is not like the normal healthy person they can secrete more insulin to stimulate the body cell to intake more glucose so they can just rely on themselves or when i do not have enough glucose i will uptake some glucose from the blood and then for statement number three loss of glucose through urine this statement is correct because the excess blood glucose cannot be converted into glycogen and stored in the liver or the muscle cells the excess blood glucose will enter the kidney and finally be excreted in the urine so it is the correct answer and one thing i would like to mention is that although this statement is valid itself it can be an extremely wrong concept for the blood glucose regulation why i say so because some students they may have the fatal misconception about diabetes diabetes all of you you know that it is a disease non-infectious disease right so the idea is that some students they misunderstood excess blood glucose can be excreted in urine that is just like a compensation mechanism oh now i know it uh, the excess blood glucose we cannot convert it into glycogen and store it in our body so that's why we cannot lower the blood glucose level in a normal way therefore you see that wow kidney it does a very good job it helps us to excrete the glucose to lower the blood glucose level mm, very nice compensation no 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 it is a very wrong concept because we know that glucose that's something we can use it break it down to release energy um, so how come the kidney really excrete the glucose this useful substance in the urine it is because of the compensation mechanism for the failure of the pancreas and the liver no in fact the presence of the glucose in the urine is due to the kidney failure to fully reabsorb the glucose from the gomer filtrate in the possible conflict tube that's something the pancreas the liver they cannot do well and the kidney cannot do well as well so as a result unabsorbed glucose molecules are excreted in the urine so that's the problem in the possible conflict in the kidney so that's why number two and three they are the correct say so although i say a lot about statement number three is still the correct answer therefore statement two and three are the correct answer <coughs> therefore statement number two and three are still the correct answer